Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to Let's Play Neverwinter Night Shadows of Undrantide. Where we are in the final stretch, it seems. Our duties for uh, Ashtara, our Asabi slave owning friend over there, of which we are technically one of his slaves for now, um, our duties for him have been completed. And now we must make our way to the top of the Temple of the Winds here in Undrantide to stop Eurydus. Uh, unfortunately, there's a big magical barrier preventing us from doing so, and the only way to turn it off is to find three MacGuffins known as the Dead Wind, the Dark Wind, and the Wise Wind, which are probably, you know, presumably housed in different areas of the, uh, the city complex here that we find ourselves in. So we need to go find them, and once we do, well, then the, uh, the final confrontation with Eurydus will finally begin, it would seem. We can only hope, anyway. Come on, guys. Pathfinding? Much? What are you guys doing? Come on. I, I, I need you to follow me. Oh, really? We're off to a good start, then, I see. Um, so, anyway. I will apologise in advance today if my gameplay at all seems a little rusty. It's because I haven't played the game in a little while. Um been actually like about a week or two since I last. Oh, for the love of... Just go through the door. Thank you. Um, it's been a, like a week or two since I last played the game. Unfortunately, some real life stuff has been getting in the way and I haven't been able to sit down and do a serious recording session for a while. So I apologize for that. And that's the entrance to the temple, by the way. Right there. Uh, however, we need to journey around this complex and try and get back to the bits that we've already checked out in order to recover these McGovern winds, artifacts, things, as I've already explained. Now, we cleared out pretty much all of these hallways around here previously, although I wouldn't be surprised if some of them have repopulated with more surprise spiders. So let's try and be a little cautious at least. I would love if my party members would actually keep up with me. That would be fantastic. All right, so here... I believe this was one the library or something? It's the one that I accidentally destroyed the sign for outside with a fireball. <laughs> um, so, yeah, let's check it out. The Great Library. Yeah, here we go. I know not what awaits us within. Uh, methods. An ancient dust method, specifically. Uh, Marvellous. I, I guess. Um, chaotic and destructive methods come in many shapes and have a whole wide range of abilities. Most are drawn from the various elemental and quasi-elemental planes. We better kill it then, I suppose. I think that would be a good idea, and I'm getting a lot of stuttering today, and I don't really know why. Guys, let's attack the method, shall we? Or was I standing in the way or something? Not a problem. And wow, yeah, what is with the performance right now? What is going on? Just one second, folks. I'm going to go figure out what the heck is wrong with my computer right now. Okay, we're back. I think it's fixed now. Problem was uh, Steam was trying to download an update. Thanks, Steam. I could have sworn it was set to not do that, honestly. Um, while the game is actually running. But apparently not. Moldy tome, moldy tome. What do we have on this bookcase? We have... What is the game doing right now? We have... Okay, great. Uh, there was also bones. There we go. I don't know how I accidentally selected the bones there for like a split second and then switched to the bookcase. That was very odd. That was not my input. As far as I can tell, I just clicked on the bookcase. Um, okay, well, fine. I feel the need to search these bookcases. You never know when there might be something that's actually quite important on them. A foul odour clings to the pages of this ragged book. In rather gruesome terms, it discusses the process by which a powerful arcanist can slowly transform himself into a lich. The frankness with which the topic is discussed leads you to believe that this was a relatively common practice in ancient Netherall. Yeah, we've kind of had our fair share of ancient... Netheries, liches, and mummies and things, so... 
This much is abundantly clear to us at this point, I'm afraid. What, uh... What cloak am I wearing right now? Cloak ah, still the cloak of Arachnida. Um... I might stick with it for now, based on the fact that I have no idea what, what's waiting for us in here. Oh yes, and here's the spell staff that I still don't know how... I don't know what Gust of Wind or Flame Lash does. I have no, absolutely no idea. I will undoubtedly try it out on an enemy at some point, and we shall experiment. Um, because there's, well, there's definitely going to be something waiting for us in the next room, at least. Quick save! When you're ready, game. It's been a bit slow today in general, even after having stopped Steam from downloading. I could probably do with rebooting my PC, honestly. And that is a dust elemental. And it's humongous. Challenger and challenging. Born of the quasi-elemental plane of dust, these creatures are denizens of hidden or forgotten places. There are no known limits to their size and have been known to grow to considerable proportions. Yeah, apparently. I think we should kill this dust method pretty quick. Wait, it can cast spells? Deacon's casting haste, huh? Um, wounding whispers. I don't like the sound of wounding whispers. I'll be honest. That sounds horrible. All right, now where's it going? All right, let me just... Ugh. Joy. I don't know if dust is particularly combustible. Let's hope it is. And run. Damaged door and a bookcase there, apparently. Where has he gone? Uh, do we have another method? We do. I always get my way. Uh, methods are not really a problem for us at this level. Luckily. I do not know where this dust elementals run off to, though. Remains. More bullets. Why are they why are they all carrying bullets? I don't understand. Temple of the Winds, Rites and Rituals. We already have this book. So that is not required. Luckily. Also rather lucky that um Oh! Hello! Alright, well, you know what I think of you? That's, this is what I think of you. Alright, that's eliminated a few of them. Good stuff, and there is our dust, oh, we got multiple dust elementals, uh, okay. A little concerning, but okay. Also, that's done something horrible to us. Evil mind? We failed to resist it. I don't know what that's done to us. Probably something nasty. Hmm. I'm not sure. Badly wounded and injured. We have another ice storm to throw around. Let's wait for them to stop moving. Okay. They're big and scary looking. But being one of the few enemies, it seems, at this stage of the game, which aren't resistant to magic and damage resistant and regenerating and all that associated nonsense, they're actually not quite as scary as they look. Which is jolly nice, I have to say. Makes a change to fight something I can actually cast spells at. <laughs> Says we right for not taking spell penetration a hell of a lot sooner, I guess, but, you know... Doesn't make it any less frustrating. With the benefit of hindsight, you can bet I certainly would have taken spell penetration, though. Lots of ranks of spell penetration. But hey, we live and learn. And luckily, we have plenty of muscle to back us up in the form of uh, Barry the Bear and Colin, sort of. Um, and our own uh, polymorph abilities to kind of, uh, you know, 
make up for that. Um, anyway. Oh, that's just bolts. I don't think we're interested in that. Let's get the map up here. Okay, this place isn't too big. I was, I mean, I don't want to speak too soon. It might have a lower level or something, but I was genuinely a little bit concerned that we might have a really big dungeon crawl to go through here. And oh, good lord. Um, <laughs> I didn't mean to close the door there, but that is an appropriate reaction. Uh, hello, everyone. Where can I put this ice storm? Well, it's three of you now. Okay, this this is a little more concerning, admittedly. Let's get another round of that. Sometimes being a sorcerer is just the best thing. Don't know what this blue fog is, though. That's concerning. Oh, poor Deacon. He's getting hit by all sorts of stuff right now. Mayor, maybe you should move so that the bear can get in here. Alright, uh, I'm out of ice storms. Which is a shame. I'm not out of fireballs, though. So I think we've been dazed or something? Quickly losing track. Alright, oh my god, how many? Alright, now we're definitely dazed. Collins out. Resummon him shortly, though. That's not a problem. As soon as we snap out of whatever this is. Come on. Come on, Vera. Get your... Yeah, there we go. Marvellous. Let's kill this thing. Annoying creature. Uh, Deacon, how are you doing over there? Uh, he seems to be taking a lot of spells, but he ain't dead. Let's mop up these guys. All right, okay, hold on. Let me move around so we can actually get a good shot. Oh, beautiful. I don't know what this blue... Gust of wind, sleep. Maybe it's gust of wind? But it's, you know, bright blue for some reason. We're testing my knowledge of D&D uh, 3rd Edition uh, spells and mechanics to the limits here, really. We are playing well beyond any level I was I ever experienced when I played the pen and paper RPG myself. So, as I, I think I've probably said before, but yeah, we, we, we I typically ended up working with low-level characters, both as a DM and as a player. So, also, I do, I'm clicking on all the wrong stuff right now. Um, I think most of these remains are just bullets, aren't they, for some strange reason. They're all just like bullets plus two. I mean, I guess I could, ta I could take them. Like, they're probably worth something. But it's a bit... I, a, it's a little strange. Um, B, I'd love potions instead, honestly. Just maybe just one potion game. Maybe just one. Just one little potion, please. Just one tiny little potion. We may want to consider resting in this room before we move on as well. I'd like to get my ice storms replenished. But it is encouraging that we've managed to make it this far without it, and also without having to do the bull strength, shield, haste, umber hulk, polymorph you know, strategy of doom, which, you know, is great. It's thoroughly destructive against certain types of enemies, but it was getting a little bit boring having to do it constantly, but luckily all the golems seem to be dealt with for now. The beggar's love. Just because it covers the pages of this unassuming romance novel, it is leveling... Should I start again? Should I try and narrate it in English this time? Dust covers the pages of this unassuming romance novel. It is lovingly illustrated, though the inks have dulled with age. Whoa. Okay. Hi there. Gendra, sweet Gendra, you are gone. Betrayed by kin and clan and I, your William. 
I can do nothing more for you than weep, O oh gods. Thy names are cruelty and injustice. Oh no. Colin? Yes, Vera? I think we're trapped in a Shakespeare knockoff. Oh dear. This, this is a rather terrible state of affairs. Oh, what's a Shakespeare? You, well, it's uh, complicated, Deacon. I'll explain later. Um... What, what happened? How can I help? Uh, no, uh, do you know how to find the Wise Wind? The Wise Wind? I have heard the name, though I know not where. But what use have you for a beggar such as me? I am blind and lame and with a broken heart besides. Please, leave me to my sorrows. Who, who is this gender you weep for? A girl with the softest voice and the smoothest skin. Her lips upon mine were ever tender. Noble by blood and nobler yet by soul. I loved her, and she loved me in return. What happened? How can I help? On learning of our love, her stepmother sent her to that monastery across the way, and the ill wind comes from it. Though I can smell it on the air, I fear for her. Can you not charge to her rescue? Oh, that I were a knight, and had the means to do so. Alas, since birth, the gods have cursed me with eyes that cannot see. And a twisted leg that leaves me lame. Also, I am a level 1 character, and this quest is definitely designed for a level 10. Uh, it is enough that I have made it this far without dying heartbroken, blind, and lonely within the depths of some crevasse. Oh, sweet Gendra, this world is a tragedy for us both. Well, calm down. Everything's going to be okay. Okay. That is all my life can ever be now without her. Gone are the days of wonderful and splendid. Gone is her beauty from my world. Everything is drab and plain and ordinary again. Goodbye, William. Go. I pray you live a happier, less accursed life than mine. I wouldn't bet on it. Okay, so. Perhaps my hopes were confounded. We're going to be taking some trips into books, it seems. How peculiar. Can't identify an armor. Greenleaf. Through the years, elven craftsmen constructed many of these suits for the defense of their homes. The leather of the armor cleverly designed to blend with the forest during the exodus of the calling. Uh, some of this equipment found its way into the hands of adventurers, and from there to black markets. It is not known what the elves think of this acquisition now that the retreat has concluded. Interesting. Uh, Deacon? Is this any good for you? It's actually the same as the plant chainmail plus two. Oh, interesting. Armor, blown, armor bonus plus five AC modifier. And bonus to hide as well. That's impressive. That is very impressive. Sadly, there's nothing we can really do with this chainmail except maybe try and put it in a bag. There we go. Oh, hang on. I simply can't carry all of this. Oh, damn it. Uh, can we put it in the greater magic bag or is it full? Uh, I might be able to find some room for it, actually. Hey, wait a minute. Right, where? Get in the back. For heaven's sake. There we go. Now, now we're good. If I can sell that to get some extra money to maybe buy an, an extra nice little artifact before the game's end, I'm going to keep it for now. But uh, that's some incredibly good leather armor. Wow. It's like leather armor plus five with a, with a, with a skill bonus. Crazy, crazy pants. Crazy business. Let's have a little rest here, shall we? In this nice fictional forest glade. This is a little strange, but alright. <laughs> fiction within fiction, folks! Fictionception! Right, let's uh, summon ye old Barry again. Welcome back.
Whoa, hello. Intruders, come, sister. They must not let them interfere with the ritual. Uh, well, then. Okay, well, you didn't last very long. The Holy Priestess, challenge rating easy. Well, then. Casting unknown spell. Oh, mate, honestly, they're all unknown spells to me half the time. <laughs> Even if it tells me what it is. Crumbling bookcase. A multi tome. No. A weapon rack. Containing an, ident an identified heavy crossbow. A rotten heavy crossbow. Oh, lovely. Um. Well, I must say, this is a somewhat charming little diversion. I wasn't expecting this at all. I was expecting a dungeon crawl with more and more and more spiders. And probably even more golems. But actually, I am pleasantly surprised. Also, can you please die? What are you doing, bear? What in the... That's a devil. That is a devil. Weirdly enough, it's challenge rating easy. It doesn't look like it ought to be challenge rating easy, though. Let's, uh... Little Deacon, you're in a bit of a state. Summon a Colin. And uh, attempt to heal Deacon, I suppose. Um... That did not help very much. Right, here's the thing. You guys need to... Uh, you ladies need to die right now. I've had enough of you. Oh, boy. Oh, dear. Oh, good heavens. Oh, there's the devil. Um... Okay, this did not go as planned at all. Um, and our last quick save was a while ago. Oh dear. <sighs> Bother. Gotta do this, this room all over again now. Ah, oh, man, that's annoying. I have to spam all the nasty spells we've got, get this over with nice and quickly. Would somebody like to kill this thing, by the way? Oh, bear, come on, get in here. Thank you. I'm going to actually get a party wipe this time. After doing it successfully last time. I wouldn't, it wouldn't at all surprise me. Spell fail interrupted. Ah, oh, game! You do this to me. Stunned. This is most annoying. Alright, get him, bear. Show those methods who's boss. Right, I'll have to summon you again, looks like. Welcome back, bear. Uh, okay, let's get a nice storm on you guys. Crowd control up in here, thank you very much. Would sleep work on you guys? It's a thought. Oh, 
doesn't look like it. Oh, Deacon. Uh, I'm out of area of effect, aren't I? This is a problem. Um, where's... No, not that. Yes. Emergency backup fireball. Break, gla break glass in case of method infestation. Pains me to have to use it since we didn't have to last time, but there we go. Also, yeah, don't, don't. Ah, oh, I've been blinded. Fantastic. Um, no, game, no. Why are you making Mephit such a big deal? When they really shouldn't be. How long is this gonna last for? Right, there we go. Right, just just chew through them, bear, come on. So we can't do you to PvP settings? Are you serious? Wait, are we still stunned or something? We are. I'm not getting the stunned animation, but I am stunned. There. Attack. Right, we're back in action, I think. Why is this... This is always happens, doesn't it, in games? You go through the fight the first time successfully, and then a reload forces you to do it again, and it ends up being an absolute nightmare. Even though the first time it seems so easy. It always... Oh, it's done it again. Don't finish that last one off. Come on. You cannot stop the bear! Is the bear and the maiden fair, and they have come to destroy all methods? Because they're so annoying. There we go, finally. Am I even going to loot all of these bullets this time? I'm not. You know, sod that, actually. As a matter of fact, sod it. Yeah. Uh, you also need healing, Deacon. Welcome back to the land of the living. Let us rest. Before entering the, 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 the book this time. I will enter the same book. I won't try the other one. Um, <sighs> heaven's sake. That was more work than it should have been. And since we're not in Spider-Land anymore. It would appear. Let's swap, swap out our cloak. Alright. Okay, we'll have a little chat with you again. Goodbye. We'll get the nice armor. Oh. There we go. I will put this in my bag. I can't carry all of this. Open. Marvelous. And quick save. Let's go kill some evil priestesses. These first two are easy to deal with. It's the next room that's uh, a bit mad. Okay. I didn't notice this other weapon right last time. Thunderstone, alright. Okay, boys and girls, we are going to prepare for this place. Oh, yes, we are. 
Everybody gets haste. This is cutting down on my fireballs available to me, sadly, but it's worth it. Full strength as well. For you. And for you. Deacon, you won't need full strength. Um, I'm not going to polymorph. Because there's still damage I can do with my spells in this particular instance. I am going to... Oh, you know what? Yeah, fine. I'll do resistance as well. Why not? Um, who knows? That plus one could make all the difference. Uh, also... What am I looking for here? I'll give us something. Shield. There it is. Alright. Let's do this. Right. Grand Matron and friends. Ooh. Direct hit. Very nice. One more fireball. For good luck. Alright, you can get lost. That death scream is very repetitive and very annoying. I'll just finish her off. For the, for the love of everything that's holy, please just die. For I do. Ow. Have I been slowed or something? No, strength has been decreased though. Alright. Summon skeletal, skeletal warrior and we have the, the devil. Not, not Beelzebub himself, but a devil. As in, you, you, there are many devils in in in, in uh, Dungeons and Dragons. There are also demons, which are completely separate things, as it turns out. Um, devils are uh, lawful evil, and demons are chaotic evil. So they don't look much like each other either. But anyway, uh, vain servants of the dark gods, devils have long been known to meddle in the affairs of men, even in fictional books, it seems since that's what we're in right now. This is all getting very strange, admittedly, but, you know. Uh, have an ice storm. You come too late here, Lord. I have already claimed the maiden soul. Uh-huh. Have a magic missile. Several, in fact. Oh, did you ignore that? I think you might have done. Spell resistance increased. It's only spell resistance, it's not some spell immunity, I mean, it's not that at least, you know, that going for us. I would like to heal myself. My health is getting dangerously low, there we go. Uh, would, isn't, would now be Umberhawk time? I feel like now might be Umberhawk time. Sorry, Vera Hulk time. Vera Hulk is in the house! In three, two, one. Time to get wrecked, Devil. The Hulk is here. Should have done haste again on myself, but never mind. I don't think I could have actually anyway. Now I run out of uh, slots. Wow, this thing is not taking any damage at all. Is this something I should be doing instead of just trying to fight the Devil face to face, in spite of the fact that he's challenge rating easy? Gendra's corpse. I do hope we didn't accidentally kill Gendra. The fact that it's called Gendra's corpse, maybe? I don't know. Actually. I'm too excited to talk right now. I wasn't going to try and talk to the corpse. I was going to loot it, but if you can say so. What do we have here? I can't, I can't identify any of this stuff because I'm an Umber Hulk. <laughs> my intelligence may have taken a hit, or at least my spells have. Um, I'm going to try and have to try and remember to identify this stuff. Um, well, this is a problem. The devil seems to be completely immune to damage. I 
can't seem to put a dent in him. Even with a critical... Oh, no, there we go. Barely injured, but he's regenerating, isn't he? That's the problem. Weapon ineffective. Oh, man. What? All right. How do I un 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 myself? There we go. Let us investigate some of these items. There might be something important here. The pen in particular seems to catch my eye. Um, I feel like the, it, the fight should not be this hard. Um, the fringes of this quill pen seem ragged and sparse, but the nib is firm. Regardless, you will require some ink before you can use it. Uh, bother. Belt of Hill Giant Strength. Hello. What's my current belt? I'm now really strong. Um, strength 15. It's not bad. Um, it's before we turn into an Umber Hulk and do that, that sort of nonsense. Uh, it's got a potion of bull strength. What was the other stuff we picked up? It's a crossbow. Wow, I still can't identify it. How are these boots? Still can't identify the boots either. Wow. Okay, that's a first for a while. Alright, what am I... There's gotta be something here I'm missing. You're doing great, Deacon. Uh, let me just summon you some help. debuffs on me right now. I don't like that. What am I... What is it that hit me that did all that? Yikes. Anyway, uh... Sadly, it appears that you've arrived too late and the fears of generous level William were well founded. Pr this pretty young maiden has been sacrificed in some sort of unholy ritual. Yeah, I noticed. Uh, do, 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 do some remains over there. I, d I don't feel like that was the quickest way to get to it, Vera. Honestly, your pathfinding is questionable there, but okay. Um, remove disease. Oh, probably. What's through here? Is going into this bit a horrible mistake? Possibly. Oh, I think Deacon's like straight up dead. That's that's no good. Well, hold on. On the nature of hell. Too excited to talk right now. Of course I am. Uh, right, we're gonna have to reload if Deacon's dead. Yeah. Oh, he's near death. Hopefully, I can bring him back. You with us again, Deacon? Yeah, come with me. <laughs> Jesus. Um. Still only barely injured. Ugh, this sucks. Maybe we should retreat. Maybe we should just get the hell out of here. Except the devil's blocking the door. Uh, okay. get, get out of my get out of my face! I've already claimed the dirt the maiden saw sort of blah blah blah. Yeah, great for you, Mr. Devil. Something holds you here within this foul temple. Oh no, this tail only moves forward and never back. Oh crap. Stupid book. Oh, we're in trouble. It seems to be an almost never ending battle. This is ridiculous. Um. We just have to try and batter the damn thing. I don't know. Seems to just eat all the magic I throw at it, so. Oh, that did it. There we go. Oof. I was about to have to resort to being the Umber Hulk again. Phew. 
I think we got very lucky on our penetration roll there or something. I don't know. Okay. Yes, you've arrived too late. Uh, this pretty young maiden has been sacrificed in some sort of unholy ritual from which you can never return. All right. And now this book. First, though, freaking rest. <laughs> that was, um, harrowing. Just, you know, to say, to say the least. Very unusual fight. 